بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم لإلاف قريش إلافهم رحلة الشتاء والصيف فليعبدوا رب هذا البيت الذي أطعمهم من جوع وآمنهم من خوف. So today, some things about Surah Quraysh, a surah that follows immediately after Surah Al-Fil. This surah is broken up easily into two parts. It's a very short surah, but in, you can think of it in two parts. The first part of it is what Allah does for the people of Quraysh. He does it. He does certain things for the convenience uh, of Quraysh, and. What does he do? He has opened things up for them in a way that they can travel in the summer and the winter in the most convenient of times and not worry about being robbed and ransacked by all the other tribes who are known for robbing and ransacking. Why? Because they are custodians of this house. So Allah says, why did I give you all these conveniences? Why did I protect you against the army of the elephant in the previous surah that is? For what purpose? Why should, what should you give in return? فَلْيَعْبُدُوا رَبَّ هَذَا الْبَيْتِ They should worship the master of this house. They should engage in the worship of the master of this house. Instead of saying they should worship Allah, he said they should worship رَبَّ هَذَا الْبَيْتِ Now why? He said that particular language because that house was built by Ibrahim السلام, for a purpose. The purpose of the worship of one God alone. Look at what you've done with that house. How could you enjoy all the benefits that came to you as a result of being custodians of this house and violate the sanctity of that house itself? How could you do that? And that's actually the question that's posed to them. And in that you understand that this surah is actually a culmination of the previous surah, is directly connected to the previous surah. Ibrahim salam's prayer is fulfilled here. The first part of that prayer was, give them safety. Rabbi ja'al hadha baladan aminan. The second part of that prayer was, warzuq ahlahu min thamarat Provide them from all kinds of provision. All kinds of fruit. So Surah Al-Fil was how Allah made it safe. And Surah Al-Quraysh is how He makes it prosperous, how He gives them all kinds of fruit. They get to travel around. That's the phrase peace and prosperity. They go hand in hand. Peace in Surah Al-Fil, Surah Al-Fil and prosperity in Surah Quraysh. You know in a society if you have peace and no, no prosperity, you can't survive. So what if your house is safe? You can't get a job, you'll starve. But what if there is prosperity, but there's no peace? Your home isn't safe, your bank isn't safe, your car isn't safe. You can't survive. You need both of these things to survive. And Allah gave both of those things to the Quraysh. So they may survive and prosper as a society and flourish as a society. And He asked one thing in return, worship the master of this house, restore the legacy of Ibrahim alayhi salam.